Hey guys, welcome back. And today in uh, Parametrics, we're going to, m to move on to the surface. Okay, so how do we set up a surface? Well, first off, we can just come in here and set one up really quick, like that. And now, simply setting, we, j we just follow the same procedure as always, simply setting up a surface, right click, uh, clicking it, set one surface, and there you have it, one surface has now, has now been set. Okay, now uh, let's, let's imagine you want to set up a surface, but instead of using uh, an existing plane or surface, you want to set it up through lines. You can just go in here, go one, two, three, set up one curve here, and one curve here. And now we need to set these up real quick, so we go into curve, control C, control V, and now one and the other, go like this, right click, like this. Now we just need to pick up the loft command and simply put in one and then with your shift button put it put in two. And of course you can also add in more curves. So if you add in one like this, control C control V and then set one curve to be this one, then connect connect it in. You now have this much more uh, complete sur uh, surface. And of course if you if you want to go to more Zaha Hadidish uh, design you can just adjust these and the whole surface will then uh, adjust naturally okay now let's imagine you want to set up a surface through uh, points if you set them up up to four points I'm gonna pick up multiple points so one two three four you can use this command here which is four points from from surface right in point like so Copy this at least four times, and now one by one you just go one, set one point two, set three, and of course set four. Now if you just pick this up and then just put them in one by one. You'll see here as you can simply set one with just three points and of course now with four points. And yes, this kind of, cir of, cir of circumstance might happen, so simply switch these and you should get your surface, which you can now change easily just by moving the exact points. Okay, now let's imagine you, you have something like, like a closed polyline, like this. So how do you set this one up? So curve, same thing once again, simply select that curve like that and now we just we can just go into this <clears throat> boundary surface and then click it there and as you can see a surface has now been, been set inside this polyline okay 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 guys hope you like that uh, tutorial and I hope to see you here next time